Hi, it's Whitney Freya. Here I am coming to you again, out of breath and outside in Wallowa County. I am cross country skiing this morning and I had to bring to you another life art aha to inspire our transition out of the past nine year cycle and into 2017 and your next nine year cycle. Many of you know I am gathering with many of you for Sacred Circle Day coming up on December 28th and again on December 30th. So you have two different days that you can join in. And we are going to look back from an eagle's eye perspective and honor the last nine years, wrap up any loose ends, identify any patterns we do not want to take into the next nine years. This is huge, you guys. Whatever we don't kind of identify, wrap up and love and put on the shelf is going to come with us into the next nine years. So I really want us to take the time in 2016 in the last days here to honor the art that is our life and intentionally vision into what it is we want to experience in the next nine years. So here's the aha I just had while I was cross country skiing. And this is the same whether you're shooting basketball hoops, riding a horse, paragliding, anything you're doing physically in life, sports wise, as well as in your day to day life will benefit from this tip. Here it is. You have to look, send your vision and your attention to where you want to go. Not where you don't want to go. When I'm paragliding, I've been told if I look where I don't want to land, that's where I'm going to land. I have to look where I want to land. My middle daughter is a horse girl. She's a rodeo court girl. And if she wants that horse to turn, she has to look first and then the horse is going to turn with her. So it's the same thing in our life. When you are looking ahead, like when I'm cross country skiing today, I have to look like 10 feet ahead to not topple over. <laughs> as soon as I focus my attention ahead to where I want to go, I'm able to ski so much smoother. And it's the same thing in the art that is your life. So this is what we are going to do on Sacred Circle Day. And I want to invite you to join me. Click the link below and read the information. We are going to, you ready? You're going to lie down. You're going to get super comfy. You're going to light your candle and I'm going to guide you in meditation with singing bowls and sage burning into your most magnificent future. And it's not about imagining how it's going to happen. It's about connecting to how you want to feel. What is the energetic wake you are going to leave in your path the next nine years? Let's get really clear on that. And that is going to help the universe and everything around you support you. You are going to align with a future reality that you choose. If you don't, life will choose for you. You'll be bombarded by day-to-day -day activity. Let's create magical intention. Please join me for Sacred Circle Day. Okay, my fingers are about to freeze. I gotta go. Love to you all. Go to tinyurl.com slash sacred circle day. Everything will be recorded. You'll have access forever. I'm offering it on the 28th and the 30th. Do it. The more of us that vision into a loving, exciting, compassionate future, the better it will be for everyone. Okay. Love to you. Merry Christmas. Happy holidays. Bye-bye.